today. Um, I didn't even realize you guys were here. Well, now that you're here, let's make some DIY pins. Should we? I think we should. Okay, so let's get into the supplies that you'll be needing. Now that you guys are here, let me turn this off. Okay. Alright, let's do this. My cat. Thing. Okay. Yes, I am in my PJs today. I didn't feel like changing. And I have some hot chocolate. We are going to be making a quite different type of pin today, but it is still a pin. So, I did a video, I think it was about five minutes long. Um, I think it was yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. And I also did a short, but I also want to do another video. So, it's this tutorial. How to make a pin that looks just like this. And so the supplies that you'll be needing is um, a bottle cap. Today, I'm going to be using a Ganoid bottle cap. Because I just like having the largest, the largest surface. And I haven't tried bottle cap yet. So, let's try this. So, you can just use a normal water bottle. Like, not a reusable one, like, just, like, water that you can buy at the grocery store. So, you can use that, or you can use a Gatorade cap, which that's what I'm doing, because we have so much Gatorade as we did to this. So, the supplies that you'll be needing is safety pins. I have, um, a 140 pack. You definitely do not need this much. But, you know, that's... It's good. Um, you'll just need one for this craft. You can also do multiple pins in a sitting. I'm not going to judge you. So, yeah, safety pins. You'll be needing some scissors. Some, um... Hold on. just a normal sheet of paper i'm using printer paper that's what i use for most of my crafts and that's i'm drawing in my sketchbook so printer paper um a pencil i don't have a eraser on mine so and i tried those pencil caps they don't stay on so i like to use this eraser this one's cool you don't need this one obviously but like you pull this and it goes up it's really cool I'm pretty sure I found it at the dollar store. You'll need some markers, which I can't show you, but I can grab a couple. Because I don't have a tripod or ring light, so I'm using my markers right now. And then you'll need... I use a pen. I know that's not real artists use, but I'm using a pen. Uh, hot glue. Hot glue sticks you'll be needing... Um, it depends on how full your hot glue is. Um, is that it? And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. So, let's just get into this. So, I have to actually plug in my hot glue then. Alright, I plugged in my hot glue. So, while that's warming up, we're going to take a sheet of paper. And you're going to take your bottle cap, put it on the piece of paper. This side facing upwards, this side on the paper. You can also do it the other way around, it doesn't really matter. But, yeah. I'm 
going to trace your bottle cap. Okay, so once you have traced your bottle cap, I'm just going to go around the edges a little bit again. So, I'm going to color it first. You don't have to. It just is a little bit easier for me. So... I think I'm going to do a little cat in a garbage can. So I'm going to finish drawing and I will be right back. Sorry if you hear my dog barking in the background, but I'm done. So now I'm going to outline it. on my bathroom okay so now I'm gonna let this pen dry and yeah Hold on. I'm trying to hide from our dog because I don't want to distract him I'm trying to get my brother to take out the dog so they won't be barking. That's what my dog just did. Okay. Thank you. Okay. So now um, I have this that came with my markers that I use to like swatch the colors. So, I'm going to get my colors. Mm. I need gray. I don't have... Oh, I do have gray. Okay. I would hope I have, would have gray. Okay. Okay, now I need a color for the cat. Bob, be quiet. I'm trying to film a video. I can't find the color that I'm looking for. I know I have one. That I know. Where is it? Oh my god, it was right in front of my face. That's a good color. It's gonna be a cat doing this. It's gonna be a cute kitty. Okay. Now I need to do the background color. That's a good background color. Okay, so now I'm done and um, I'm going to show you guys. And there he is. So now you're going to cut it out. I'm also, I also like to do 
a little piece around the edge. I think it just looks better that way. You don't have to do it. That's just what I like to do. But you also can if you want. Where's my roller? I like to do it a little bit longer than I need, just because I like to go be on the safe side. Okay, that should fit. Oh, crap. Okay, did this color for the background. So now we're just going to color that in. So now you're just going to cut that out. I kind of feel bad for my brother right now. Because like all rooms are like right next to each other. So he can probably hear me. such a bad sister, but that's what older sisters do. Like this. So, like this is the wall I'm knocking on. And like right here, behind this wall is... His dresser, where his TV is. <laughs> Does he not hear anything? I just knocked over everything. Okay. Sorry guys, my room is a mess. What are you doing? What is that? <laughs> Don't you dare do it. So, that's trash. Okay, that's really long. It's like that longer. That much longer than it needs to be. But it's okay, when I reach where I need to cut it off, I'll cut it off. It's fine. Now I'm going to cut out the circle. Huh, I'll be back. I'm going to go ask my brother if he heard me knocking. Hi guys. Today, hold on. Go, hold on. Just wait. So, I got my brother with me. But, come here. Come here. Yeah. There he is. No. They can no. see. Hi. But no. quick. quick. No. So, I'm making DIY pins right now. And I was telling them, like, I feel like such a joke right now because, like, I feel like such a joke because, like, you can probably, you can hear me, like, <laughs> talking. Can you hear me talk in all my videos? Yeah. Dang. But not outside. Yeah, I'll show you a hallway so you can kind of get an example of, like, how... Our hallway looks so like this is like so I'm a I have a lot of medical issues so this is the med counter that 
my parents built just for me. Because you take meds. Yeah, so that's all the stuff they built. And, like, that's all the metal core equipment I have. Like, it's crazy. You. This is my little sister's room. This is my and room. And this is my room. And then this is his room. Room tour. So his room is really cool because, like, he loves camo. So, like, my mom literally painted that. Camo. Yeah. That's green. This side's camo. So, like, basically, green. they actually built this room. This used to be, like, open. But they Lisa, built this room. I need to tell you something. This used to be my room. And then this used to be my big sister's room. That, But now she lives in our... She, now she lives in our finished basement. So now I live in this room, her old room. My little sister lives in my old room. And then this used to be... Downstairs. Ash no. This used to be in my little sister's room. So, like, I hope that makes sense. It's, like, really messy. So, like, yeah. Cat, what are you doing? Okay. So let's continue. So there it is. We got the trim. So I think the hot glue gun is pretty much warmed up. And then I made this one yesterday. I'm gonna need like have to. It's kind of messy on this right now. A long, a long time ago. Oh yeah, he lived used to live in our finished basement. So, like, yeah. But, like, he would mostly spend the night up here because, like, obviously, he doesn't want to be down there alone. But, like, most of the time, so we had an aunt that lived here, but my mom and her got into a huge fight. I'm not going to go into that because it was horrible. No, we so, have two now moms. she, yeah, we have two moms. So, we didn't always have two moms. Uh, my parents are actually divorced. Um, You might... I think I have told you guys that before. But, yeah, my parents are divorced. So, now we have two moms. Okay. We had one before, now we have two. So, I think for this one, I'm going to have to, like, figure out what one I'm going to use. I think I'm going to use the biggest. So we're imagining like, like a house. I don't want to imagine. Like a more imagine like a house on top of a house. That's basically what we have, um. Cause like, our downstairs is like a house. So now, actually, when my our two moms are at work. Normally, my big sister watches us because she's 13. My little sister's four, going to be turning five really soon. My brother's seven. I'm ten. Yeah, I don't know if I mentioned our ages before. That's just nine. Yeah, but he's not part of the family. Yeah. He's just a friend. Okay, but watch out. The hog glue gun's right there. Ooh. Ooh. Bubba, stop being goofy. I am goofy. So I actually have this, some wax paper here, and that's where, like, basically I, like, put the hot glue on. Oh, Timmy glowed. Yeah? Oh, my God. I didn't know. Oh, he's bigger. He chunky. Yeah, chunky. He chunky. A different... A, now we... We have no more, we don't have a dad anymore. Yeah, but I already went into that. Ow. Oh, a little dead old cat. Like, this, I'm not even going to go into what happened the day that they decided they were going to get a divorce. Because it's horrible. Um, because all my other siblings were at... So, my little sister was at our grandparents. You, Bub, my little brother, and my big sister were at school. 
and then me, my mom, and my dad were home. Our dad was like being so I don't even know how to describe it. Like so he weird. Was a bad person. He was being like so so mean. And like basically my mom told me to go in my room because like he was whispering like a lot of things to him. Like I'm pretty sure he was like drunk, like really drunk. Um so like my mom told me to go in my room when I told her what is why is daddy saying some stuff to himself? Because, like, he was looking like psycho. So, Whoa. like, my mom told me to go in my room. And, like, I was just like, okay, what's happening? And I got really scared. So, my mom told me, to, okay, get ready. You're going to go to your friend's house. So, I basically have a nurse. I had a nurse in our old house, and she actually lives across the street from us. Like, we we go outside, go down our driveway, cross the road, and there she is. So it's she was like, she, she was just like, okay. My mom was just like, okay, you're going to go to Megan's house. And I was just like, okay, why? And she told me to get dressed, grab some stuff, like my phone, stuff like that. Because I had a phone at that time, and I still do. I'm actually filming this video on my phone right now. So, she told me to grab some stuff, get get some clothes on, because I was still in my PJs, because it was in the morning time, and I was, like, just woken up. So, like, I'm obviously not going to wake up immediately get into real clothes. I feel like so people have to do that, but I'm not going to do that, because I don't go to school. So she told me that, and I was just like, okay, why can't I just go with you? Because she had to run some errands. And she was just like, okay, I right, grab some stuff, get dressed, get your shoes on. And I was just like, okay, she grabbed my meds, because I have to take meds. Oh, let's see. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six times a day. So I was just like, okay. We went down in our basement grabbed some stuff like my school stuff because i do online school we got into a car when we were in my basement we heard the chair move and we my mom was just like okay rush up the hill we need to get to the car we got into a car my like extension where i get my meds from like got car in the door i was just like oh my god mommy help oh and like god. he was like coming up there and i'm just like we he was just like yelling at us like all these horrible horrible things i'm not even gonna say on this channel and like yeah it it was terrible like terrible terrible any you say something Lisa? what um when we had our old house before this house um i forgot i was we had or we had dad like well, yeah, but we that just happened recently. Yeah, and he was a bad person since he's not in the family. Yeah. So, yeah. Ever since, like, because, like, I didn't know, but, like, they, I thought they were super happy together. I didn't know they have been, like, fighting Ever since they got married. Ooh. So, like, I was just like, oh, my God. I was so shocked that it's been like this ever since the start of their marriage. So, I was just, like, shocked when I heard my mom say, it's been like this for 12 years. And I was just like, what? And so, yeah. They have been dating my my mom and my other mom, since, um, they were still together, the, since they weren't divorced, and I was, just, and I was just like, I freaking knew it, so, yeah, and, uh, but I'm happy as as could be, I'm just like, if my mom's happy, I'm happy, because I'm a, I'm a mom's girl, like the other parent is like, I'm all, I I'm 
always gonna be on my mom's team and like <laughs> like i'm not gonna be like i don't like the other parent i'm just like i like the parent but like i'm a mama's girl so like i'm a mama's girl i can't help that <laughs> and so like i'm always gonna be a mama's girl and i can't help it because like who's gonna be a dad's girl okay like I'm obviously gonna be a mama's girl because like that's my birth giver. She's if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be in existence. So yeah. So yeah. I think we only have the other the other parents obviously gonna get love too, but mom's gonna get more love. So yeah. I didn't even film one. So, you're going to put the piece on the front, on the, like, lid, the top part. And, like, the bottom is going to be where the pin goes. And then you're going to put your trim on. You're going to grab your safety pin, put glue on the side and the side across from it. Glue your safety pin. Make sure it dries. And then you can close it. And then, if you want to add some more touches to it, you can. But, there it is. I hope you guys enjoyed. And also enjoyed meeting my brother. Me. Um, the video, uh, I will be making a video of my friend soon. Of so, yeah, that will be up soon. Um, I love you guys so, so, so much. So much. So much. Um, and I will see you later. Goodbye.